I don't know that anybody in golf, honestly, doesn't know Hannah Berman. I mean, here's a here's a, a young lady that at 12 years old was out coming up and creating charity initiatives and volunteering her time under this umbrella of junior golf. Hannah's a very committed young lady. She has identified what her passions are and has found ways to make a difference. Well, when Hannah came here a couple years ago as a sophomore to, to Ponte Vedra, we were certainly a very good golf team and had a few seniors. But even with that, Hannah was able to take on a leadership role as a, a sophomore coming into not just a new team, but a new school. She's our vocal leader, she's our team spirit, and there's a, no question that she is our team captain. You know, I, you know, I find Hannah to be extremely mature for her age. And um, I think the thing that impresses me the most about her is that she's, she is so giving. During practice, she's always willing to, to give up her time to help some of the players that are a little bit less skilled than she is, and that speaks volumes to her that she wants to give back to the game of golf in every way possible. She's a great role model. She's um, an incredible leader, and um, I hope that more kids her age, you know, follow, you know, look up and, and follow her lead. She's coming into her own, right, as a 17-year-old. She's just getting started um, on her path, figuring out who she's going to be and what she wants to do, and uh, that's exciting as a mom. You know, we've done um, our job up to this point um, to get her independent and on her way, and um, you know, now she gets to take her wings and fly. A lot of people are concerned about issues, and Hannah has taken her concern and turned it into action. Hannah came to us about five years ago as a 12 year old and she had a personal experience uh, through a friend I think of her family who uh, was battling CF and lost. She wanted to do something to help and to fight back. I thought you know instead of saying hey I really like what you're doing maybe hey I can put myself into this and I can start helping him. Well, I, I love the name. Hitting it with Hannah uh, is, is certainly a, a great venture. And the thing that takes me most is that she's allowed to, or she wants to do it during her free time. A lot of student athletes, after they get done with competition, they get done with their practice, they want to go off and do their own thing, as many high schoolers would. But the fact that Hannah still wants to be around the game of golf and wants to give back to the game of golf is very impressive. The Child Cancer Fund is a local organization that helps children and their families through the challenges of childhood cancer. Carboard City is our premier fundraiser. Hannah started coming out about three years ago. One year she even skipped her high school's homecoming to come back and help. As a young lady, uh, there is no junior golfer in this area that has done more with charity and of giving up her time and committing themselves to this one mantra of the good of the many outweigh the good of the one doesn't take that much time. It doesn't take, it takes effort for sure, but it's selfless effort, so it doesn't seem like it takes any effort at all. It's just something that you do because you love it. I, I think the result is more than financial. I think financial, certainly, she's probably raised well over $20,000, pushing maybe 25 or 30 um, between Birdies for Charity and hitting it with Hannah and the first tea donation station that she started at our club. The example that she's able to set that she can make a difference at 12 years old, 15 years old, 17 years old, and that hopefully some of these other kids get to look at her and say, I can do that. I guess when I think of Hannah, I think that there is there is hope for all of us, you know, and that this new generation coming up, uh, and that we, as long as we have people like Hannah in the world, then we're gonna be all right. See how much that I've put into it, how much has come out of it, helping all these people, meeting all these people. It's so gratifying to know that I'm part of their success. Hannah, Coach Finley, congratulations on winning the USGA AJGA President's Leadership Award. It's certainly well-deserved. Your charitable efforts speak for themselves, and we're so proud of everything you've done for the team in Ponte Vedra High School, and we look forward to having you back next year for a terrific senior season. Congratulations, Hannah. I'm very proud of you, and thank you again for all that you do for the Child Cancer Fund. Congratulations, Hannah. You know, we all love you at CFF, and we are very, very proud of you uh, for getting this award, and also for everything that you do, have done, and continue to do for our cause. Hannah, I am so proud of you receiving this award. You certainly deserve it. 
you're going to be making a difference in people's lives for a long, long time. And I am just so proud that we are part of this.